It's time to chat with Rachel. Hey everybody. So, I know I've been uploaded a long time and stuff, but I'm here today. I know that I'm going to be talking about Mother's Day and stuff, so happy Mother's Day. I know Mother's Day was May 14th, but you'll be watching this on May 15th. And on May 15th, it is my birthday. I'll be 15 and stuff. So, yeah, I can't wait for that. Which, you guys will be watching this on my birthday, so happy birthday to me. And, yeah, so for Mother's Day, I didn't really do much at all. I did get a fidget spinner, which everybody saw it in school, so I figured I didn't need to, um, uh, bring it in here, but it's one of the red light up ones, really cool, came in this box here, and stuff, that's how you know I got it from a gas station, and, well, for my birthday, I gotten um fifty five dollars. Yes, some of it did go down the drain, but the person who made it go down the drain is paying it back to me. She owes me seventy six dollars and stuff. Um. Okay, there we go. Um, let's see here. So, for right now, what I've been putting my money into, which my room's a mess in here. Never usually gets this messy, but oh well. This is where I put my money at, which I think I showed this in one video and stuff. So, let's see the birthday cards I've gotten so far. So, I had gotten to the best thing that there is with this, like, draft type thingy and stuff. Hang on. Okay. There we go. So, this is your super sweet aunt. And you're always lots of fun. That's why I wish you. That's why I wished your birthday. That's a truly wonderful one. Happy birthday, XOXO. X. Let me see. Which my niece's name is Nisi. I have five nieces. And yes, I am a great aunt and stuff. I became a great aunt. Um forget what day it was but he is so cute and that's when I was 14 now I'm 15 and stuff so let's see get another one here this is Rachel Ballard this one's so cute okay, I'm gonna put my birthday cards right there for right now in the envelopes so this one it says Funnel cake, which funnel cake is written down here. It says happy birthday, and then it says for the Lord God, I is a son and shield. The Lord will give grace and glory. No good thing will He withhold from them that walk uprightly. For Psalm eight or eight hundred. 84 and verse 11 chapter Psalm a chapter 84 verse 11 there we go and then it says over here wishing you a day full of happiness and a year filled with joy and it says uh from a lady at church nitty I can't read that here
but yeah. Now the reason why I do get these cards, like for Christians and stuff, is because yes, I am a Christian. I don't really, or I don't really mention that at all much in my videos, um, because it just seems like if somebody's gonna embarrass me about it or something. So that's where I uh, decide not to. Uh, mention anything about it, but I also got this one from church too. It says happy birthday with kitties on it. Now, I do love kitties and stuff. It says to me, oh, happy birthday, Rachel. It's always um encouraging to see your smiling face, yeah, smiling face at church. Love and Love and Craze, Bob and Debbie. Now, they're my cousins. And I also did a, get a card from uh, Esther, my cousin. But I think I left that in my church bag, which I do not have in here at all. Because, yeah. I don't keep my bags in here. I keep some of them in here. Most of them are loaded over here stuff and yeah so I think that's pretty much it for today's video I know that's gonna be a very messy one that's because I don't know how to edit and if I did I would trust me when I get older I'll learn this stuff when I go to California so that's where I'm planning to go when I hit 18. So right now I'm 15. I'll be 18. In three years from today. Thank the Lord. <laughs> um, so yeah. With Christian life. Now you don't have to watch this part. Because it's going to be talking about the Bible and stuff. Um, for. Being a Christian. It's like a lot of work to do. Like. Yes you have to accept the Lord to your heart and everything um now the church that i go to they're very nice people i love it there they actually wanted us to invite some friends out and stuff which i'm not very good at so i'm going to put it in the video and if you would like to come you can uh to first baptist church on Jackson Ave. It's right by Freddy's. If you know where Freddy's is, if you go around the corner to the left, you'll see it and stuff. Because it's like a four-way there. You turn left and that's a big church. Well, it's not a big, big church. church, But, um, it's like red. And, yeah, it's Baptist. And we do a lot of things there. We have communion. And everything like that. When you even graduate, we have graduation parties and stuff like that. Now the text, or yeah, the text. Okay, the next two weeks I won't be there because a lot of things I'll be busy and stuff. Um, doing this, that, these, those. So, but if you want to get a hold of me at all and talk to me more on that, you know. That I have Facebook, which is Sizonico. I have Instagram, which is Rachel and Single. I have Twitter, which is also Rachel and Singer Single. Um, now to be honest, I am not single still yet. I am dating Ryan, but I made these accounts before I was dating Ryan, and I'm still dating Ryan. Um, I can't uh, remember how many weeks it's been or how many months because my mind's going crazy right now but with the whole church thing yeah we do a lot of things there we even have youth group now I don't get to go through youth group because I never had a chance to and stuff because like always busy but at youth group what they do is they play games yes you do talk a little bit about 
Jesus, uh, the people that runs the youth, like, uh, Sunday school, which is, like, my Sunday school, they're very nice, and stuff, in fact, they just had a baby on September, or, not September, wow, on St. Patty's Day, I said September because St. Patty's Day is basically the same thing as St. September, but, so, on March 17th, they had the baby, now, this month, She'll be two months old on May 17th. She's a cutie. Uh, they are husband and wife. They do really well. They went to college to teach us and everything. They even tell you about their lives, like how it was, like with their brothers and sisters. What did happen? What do you learn from it? And what do you know not to do <laughs> and stuff? It's like, what did you learn from it? Well, uh, are you, uh, what's the benefit not to do? Like, learn new things and stuff. Like, there's a lot of stories he'll tell you. And, yeah, so far, it's going really well for us. We Now, we do do devotions. That's because to earn points. But you don't really have to do them. If you don't really want to. But if you want to. What you do is. You read. Or you pick. A book. And. Like of the Bible. And then like a chapter. Like if you want to do Matthew. Chapter 1. Starting verse 1. You can. Like I have. And stuff. Actually. I'm almost through Matthew all the way. So, but you can even start on like Colossians or Philippians and, or, um, Genesis, Exodus, uh, Leviticus, Numbers, or Deuteronomy, whatever you want. Now, if you were like me, you would know all the books of the Bibles like I do. Because... Okay, um, I'm going to say all the books of the Bible right now that I remember in my brain. Let's see if I remember them all. Now, look around. I do not have a Bible anywhere in here right now. Actually, I do, but it's in this tote over in there. There's like a tote over there, that green top. Yeah, it's in there, but I do not have one out right now. So there's Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy, Joshua, Judges, Ruth, First and Second Kings, First and Second Chron Chronicles, Ezra, Nehemiah, no Ezra, Ezra, Nehemiah, Esther, Job, Psalms, Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, Song of Solomon, Isaiah, Jeremiah, Limitations, Ezekiel, Daniel, Hosea, Joe, Amos, Obadiah, Jonah, Micah, Nahum, Habakkuk, Zephaniah, Haggai, Zechariah, uh, Malachi. I hope I got all of them right. Okay, for the old books of the Bible, that was the old books. Here's the new book of the Bible. Matthew, Mark, Luke, John, X, and Romans, 1st and 2nd, Corinthians, Galatians, Ephesians, Philippians, Colossians, 1st and 2nd, Thessalonians, 1st Timothy, 2nd Timothy, Titus, and Philemon. Philemon. There we go. Titus and Philemon. Hebrews, James, 1st and 2nd, Peter. 3 Johns, because there's the 1st, 2nd, and 3rd John. Uh, let's see, June, June and Revelations, yeah, well there you have it, if you want any information, any more information that you might want to know or need to know, just message me and stuff, even if, like for instance you were at school or something, you can talk to me about it. Any free time, I don't care if it's during class or whatever. 
because there's nothing the teachers can do about it if it's like important like that to me but yeah I just wanted to get that out and tell you guys about that so that's all I have for you guys today Make sure you uh, put a thumbs up on this video, subscribe to my channel, turn the notification bell on, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!